Eric, we made the long haul. You know, it's wild to think that we are thousands of miles away from Houston, but the love for our Texans can be overwhelming. Take a look. You can see Desha and Watson up there, rather, and I want to walk you into where we're going here. This was built as a pep rally, but it's actually turned into a wild Texans party. I'm going to send photojournalist Willie Dixon in to bring you some of the live pictures here. I got to tell you that we have met some incredible Texans fans, including two, a husband and wife from Houston, who may arguably be the biggest Texans fans there. You'll have to be the judge of that. We were in Kansas City last week. That was our 25th NFL stadium to go to. Yep. The only stadium we won't go to is Dallas, but other than that, we're going to hit everyone. Take one look at Thomas and Pamela Irby's jackets. You'll quickly see they've been all over cheering on the Texans. This will be our fifth year to attend every single home and away game. The PE teacher and his wife aren't kidding, friends. We met up with them in Indy almost two weeks ago. They used frequent flyer miles to make the haul to London. It's kind of surreal just to think that in a couple of weeks we're going to be there. And um, I'm already kind of disappointed because it's going by so fast and we haven't even gotten there yet. <laughs> Along the couple's way, somewhere outside NRG, they ran into this Brit, Thomas Settle and befriended him. He looked kind of lost and started talking to him. And I said, you ain't from around here, are you? And I could tell with his British accent, he was from the UK. And that's our friend Tom that's going to be showing us around in London. I think I'm going to wear my boots to the airport. Okay. Back in Houston just days ago, the Irbys packed up their swag. They touched down in cowboy style, even giving away merch as they picked up their tickets. There you go. Settle right at their side. 50 minutes on a train compared to nine hours on a plane. The trio immediately set out to see the sights. Weird. Waiting at the airport for these guys this morning and seeing so many Texans fans walking through. Yeah, very strange. And so many more are going to be here. This is a transatlantic friendship formed out of a deep love for our Houston football team. When the plane finally got in the area, I was like so excited to be here. And now that we're on the ground and seeing Tom again has been wonderful. The jet lag or whatever it's called, having that long flight, that's going to take a while to get used to. But it's amazing. It's cold. The